For the most part, it's their first organized learning experience. Most are on campus for only half the day, enough time for some to end up in trouble. The reasons for suspensions are numerous, but they're everything from disrespecting a teacher to, you know, throwing a chair or having a tantrum. But I mean, these are not high schoolers. These are four year olds, five year olds. This Baltimore City delegate is pushing a bill to ban pre kindergarten students from being suspended or expelled. Her concern is based in part on these figures from last year when 82 Maryland pre K students were disciplined. Students in Prince George's, Baltimore City, Harvard, Charles, and Dorchester counties had the highest numbers. Suspending a young child is devastating both to the child and their sense of uh, well-being, and um, but also to the family because you know parents have to stay home from work, they have to take care of their children. The pre-K bill appears to be an important topic among city residents. Yeah, it should be prohibited, but the problem should be looked into deeper. Like, it's, they're four. That's a learned behavior, like why do they think that's okay? I think there needs to be the talk with the parents and the teachers and like what's happening within the schools because what kind of supports are the children getting at four years old if they're acting out? A key part of the pre-K suspension bill calls for more in-school support programs. That might be a better option then because it's still discipline for me that's like being in timeout and while timeout for a whole day might be rough, it's still keeping them in a controlled environment where they have supervision. There are exceptions. Students face suspension or expulsion if they knowingly bring or possess a firearm on campus. Now, this issue has been discussed numerous times before the State Board of Education. To get a closer look at that pre-bill, uh, pre rather, just go to our app. It's WBAL-TV. Live in the studio, Tim Tootin, WBAL-TV 11 News. All right, thank you.